Welcome back. In this Advent craft, we're going to make a bell to hang on our tree with some beads and yarn and a cute little brass bell. Have fun. Welcome back to another Advent craft. These are little bell ornaments that we're gonna make with yarn and pony beads. This one is actually done with sari uh, yarn. It's actually scraps of sari um, and glass beads and a little tiny bell. And here's another one used with another kind of yarn with pony beads, the same kind of bell. And you can hang them on your Christmas tree and they make a nice little sound. Okay, for this project, you'll need three pieces of yarn two feet long. You'll need a bell, a little brass bell with a wide opening, some pony beads with a wide opening, and some tape. Here we go. Let's get started. You're going to take your three ends of your yarn and you're going to take those and you're going to tie them in a knot, just a loose knot to begin with. Okay? Just like that. Then, we're going to tape the ends of these to make them a little stiffer so they'll go through the pony beads better. So we're going to take a piece of tape, just a small piece of tape, and you want to wrap it around the end of your yarn tightly so it will go through the knot, the hole of the bead. And you're going to do that to all three beads. Okay. Okay. So now all three ends are taped, that way I can push them through the beads easier. Now you need to decide, do you want to braid it? This one is braided, like you would a ponytail, okay, with the beads inserted. And this one is just tied a knot, and then you insert a bead on one of them, you string a bead, and then you tie another knot, and you insert another bead, and you tie a knot, insert another bead, and then I tied a knot around my bell, and then I inserted another bead, tie a knot, you can do it that way, or you can braid it. I think we're going to braid it this time. It's like braiding hair. So we're going to take a piece of tape, we're going to take the large knot, and we're going to tape it onto your surface. We're going to tape it, I think, a little bit above your area, okay? Then we're going to braid for a little bit. Take one over, cross one. Hopefully, cross one. Left over right. Right over left. You can make it as loose or as tight as you want. You just continue to do that. Okay. For about, let's say, five times of this. One, two, three, four. Now let's make a complete circle with this. Five. Okay. Then I'm going to add a bead. So I pick one of my beads. I'll try to use those beads. These are better. They're shorter. That's painful to get through. I'm going to twist this and poke it through the beads. It'll be easier on the pony beads. this whole thing. There we go. That goes through. Pull that all the way up and then I continue my braiding. Put that up there. So it's left over right. Right over left. Left over right. And we're going to continue doing this. Adding beads and braiding until we're almost halfway done with the string. Okay? I'll put it on time. Okay, I've got about halfway down, so now I'm going to add my bell, same way I would a bead. I'm going to take this through here, through the little hole, pull it all the way through, put that little bell up there, and this should continue braiding. And then I'm going to add more beads, three more. Okay, so I'm at the end of here, where I want to be. It matches this side here. So I'm going to tie a knot here. Take all three of them, hold on to that area, the braid, and tie my knot up in that area, the 
end of those braids. I'm going to clip off these lovely little tape ends because I don't need them anymore. And then I'm going to tie, take that piece of tape off of there, I'm going to tie these two ends together, okay? So I'm going to undo this knot a little bit and move it further, closer down. I don't really have to undo it, but I will for your sake. Loosen the knot. I'm going to tie it a little bit closer to where I stopped the braids. Or started the braids in this case. And then I'm going to tie these two ends together. So I'll just do this way. Tie them in a knot, just like you don't want to tie your shoes. my knot that I'm tying goes in between those two knots, okay? Then I'm going to cut this off even, and you have, you don't even need a hook. So here's your bell, your Christmas bell. Merry Christmas.